Wouldn't it be nice to create a full-time income while staying at home with a little one? Hey, my name is Candace from createfreedomwithcandace.com. In this video, I'm actually going to share with you how you can actually create full-time income while staying at home, specifically through an affiliate marketing business. Now, will all of this sound too good to be true? It is not. However, it still takes a lot of hard work, dedication, and determination, and consistency before, seeing the, before you can see the money rolling in. To be able to be there for your little one and not missing all of those little memorable moments is all worth it. So let's get started. So in this video, I'm actually going to share with fellow moms who wants to stay at home and not miss out the little kids moment, but still want to create a full-time income, specifically through an affiliate marketing. Now, the reason why I'm focusing on an affiliate marketing business is because an affiliate marketing business might be the easiest type of scalable online business incomes to start with. But you still have to keep in mind that there's a lot of hard work, a lot of dedication and consistency to put in before you could actually see all of those things coming in. Now, I'm actually going to go through the four simple steps. Please stick to the end because step number four, that's when you can start seeing the money coming in. And I'm actually going to throw in the bonuses as well. So real quick, if you're not familiar with the term affiliate marketing, what is affiliate marketing? Affiliate marketing basically is you refer people to someone else's product or services. It's a lot easier than creating your own product and your own services so that you don't have to deal with the customer service and producing the product and re uh, um, the return policy and all of those, right? So it's much easier to refer people to someone else's product then creating your own. Step number one, what is your brand? What are you passionate about? What niche do you want to get into? It is very important to find out what is your brand because that's how people can get relate to you, right? And that's how you can find the product and the services that you're into. Now, this might take a little bit of time for you to find, but that's okay. You could find it as you go on, right? Now, let me give you some examples so that you could actually see what I mean by, you know, what is your brand and what are you passionate about, how you can make money on those. Let's say if you are one of those um, fitness mom, you love health and fitness, right? You go to the gym all the time. Your, your brand could be something to do with fitness fitness equipment, fitness courses, whatever that is, right? Now, if you're a mom that loves to organize, right? I'm not one of those, a friend of mine, she loves to organize, right? And that could be your brand, that could be your passion, right? And another thing that you could do, if you have kids, let's say if you're a stay-at-home mom, right? What is it that you could actually do with the stay-at-home mom experience? You could actually find products and services that relate to stay-at-home. And then another thing, if you, you could actually use some of your past uh, experience. Let's say if you were an, an accounting before, right, or C, uh, a CPA, and that is something that you could actually focus on. The key is to find something that you love to talk about. Step number two, you need to do some research on who's out there that have similar brand or have similar passion. They're doing the similar things that you're doing. Not that you're gonna go and copy what they're doing, but go out there and model what they're doing. The people who are doing what you already, you wanted to do, the things that you're passionate about, go take a look at what they're doing. Take a look at what type of contents they're putting out there, what type of the, 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 the marketing platform they're using. So do some research, find a couple people who are out there doing the similar things that you wanna focus on. Step number three, what platform are you going to be building your business on, right? You have to start building an audience. In order for you to create an online business and making an income online or offline, you got to have an audience, right? You got to, we got to learn how to do the building an audience, growing an audience, building an audience. We have to engage with our audience and then we sell our audience. Those are the three basic steps of, uh, of uh, making an income. Grow your audience, engage with your audience, 
and sell your audience but you have to decide which platform you're going to be using now i'm i'm actually using youtube and moving forward i'm actually moving my business to youtube youtube is such a great platform because it's a surf as a searching engine and an at your evergreen content so when you're posting on youtube people get to search and find you and you the, the video that you put it on there it's going to be there forever until you take it down so you don't have to keep recreating contents and you could also share this content to across other platform right facebook if you're using facebook it's great everybody's on facebook most of the moms on facebook look around you how many moms that you know that are not on facebook so you could actually build your business on facebook and you could actually use some pay advertisement okay now i'm actually down the down uh, in the description i'm actually gonna probably put some link in there to actually offer some free training on different platforms so that you could actually start getting some training on different platform right instagram is also a great platform to to create to, to build your business twitter is also a great platform now all of these are great platform you just need to pick one that you're comfortable with or you just need to pick one that works well for your niche you're gonna have to learn now this is where you're gonna have to learn a little bit more getting a little bit more training on different platform how you can grow the audience from each platform how do you engage what type of content do you create for each platform again i'm gonna throw some link in the description there where you can actually pick up some free training let's move right along to step number for. What type of product and services are you going to provide that help your audience to solve their problem, right? Doesn't matter what type of product and services that you're providing. It has to be something that you are passionate about, right? We're talking about doing what you love, but also should be something that you personally use. It is very important for you to refer people to something that you personally use so that you could have actually share with them your personal experience when you're sharing content and tell them about a personal story about it, right? So let me give you some example on different type of, of uh, uh, product and services that you could actually find online and be affiliated with. So we talk about the health and wellness mom, right? Mom that's into health and fitness. If you are into the organic food and all of that, right? You could actually um, go online and find some company that actually deliver organic fruits and, 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 and vegetable to your house. And you could actually call them up and find out if they have an affiliate program. Or if you find, if you find a fitness program online, that you really love you could actually find out they have affiliate most of the company they do have affiliate program with all of this product and you could actually find out how you could become an affiliate with with the company the mom who loves to organize you could actually go to become an affiliate with amazon and you could actually find the bin the tray the, the bag and whatever those type of product on amazon and become an affiliate with amazon and you could refer people to those products right and become an amazon affiliate it's free and now if you let's say if you're a stay-at-home mom that homeschool your kids you're probably doing a lot of research and finding a lot of different um i don't know a lot of different online program or books or apps that you help to in to to help your kids with schoolwork you could actually become an affiliate with those company all it is just take one phone call and email to find out how to become an affiliate with them now if you um you know you're a cpa you accountant before and you you could actually go and take a look at what other product out there that you could actually help people like budgeting tax deductible all of those type of stuff. what type of tools out there that you could actually refer people to buy and so that you could be an affiliate with so those are the example of how you could become an affiliate with doing what you love now if you want to learn more about how to build an affiliate marketing business in the detail and exactly how to start i do have a free training on the top of this description there's a link there with 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 a training to show you exactly how to promote an affiliate program as well all right now here's the bonus while well, it's all nice to promote out of people's product but you're making portion of the commission the bonus is once you have done all of this affiliate for a while, now don't do this at the beginning, but once you start doing it for a while, you could actually create your own digital product. 
Do you understand what that means when you're creating your own digital product? Creating your own digital product, meaning you could create something just once and then it could, you could actually continue to sell. So basically you're making a hundred percent of profit every single time when somebody buying it because it's digital. Now, what type of product can you make? You say, let's say if you're the health and health and fitness mom, you could actually create a 10 day meal preps under 15 minutes. You could actually create an ebook and sell the ebook on Amazon, right? You could actually, if you are the organizing mom, you could actually create a training series, a mini training course on teaching people how to organize each room of the, in their house and just making a video of that, right? And if you are the homeschool mom, you could actually create homeschool courses, like maybe uh, uh, online courses for, for mom, how teach mom how to homeschool their kids, what type of material they need to look into, all of those, right? And if you're the accountant, you could actually start creating um, a cheat sheet or a PDF, a download, downloadable cheat sheet for budgeting, for deductible, for, for small business owner, all of those stuff. So that's it. Those are the four basic steps on how you could actually start making a full-time income through affiliate marketing while you're staying home with the little one. If you like this video, be sure to give me a thumbs up. Be sure to share this video and subscribe and actually drop in a comment. Let me know what is your passion. Maybe I could help you brainstorm on what is it that you need to look for. All right. With that being said, this is Candace from CreateFreedomWithCandace.com. I'll see you next time.